Welcome back to my dark corner of this sick world. It's weird. Mm. This week we're looking at Matango. Matango? A kind of mushroom. Known in the US as Attack of the Mushroom People. <laughs> and it's the US dub we're looking at which does have some consequences such as singer Mamie not knowing the words to a song <laughs> and some lines that presumably sounded less dumb in Japanese. It's been raining for a whole week now. It must be the rainy season. One thing I knew about this film going in is that it came close to being banned in Japan because the mushroom people's costumes resembled mushroom clouds. <laughs> And of course, director Ishiro Honda has form in addressing Japan's nuclear scars via a sci-fi concept in Godzilla. A good example of mutation caused by radiation. So I expected this to be another struggle between man and metaphorical monster. <laughs> not exactly. It's not. This is much darker and deeper than Toho's usual output. I've waited a long time to hear you say that. Based on a short story by William H. Hodgson, it's one of those films that puts a disparate group of people far from the constraints of civilization and sees how long it takes for them to turn on each other. A genre that includes films like Lord of the Flies and Stagecoach. That's all your fault that we're in trouble now. What's that? With the caveat that John Wayne never turned into a mushroom. <laughs> the biggest question about this film is, does the mushroom stuff enhance the point or undermine it? Everything seems pretty weird. There's a lot to like about Matango. Yes, it starts slowly. I don't want to tell you the story. Yes, it's not subtle. The weak restraints of society disintegrate in the face of the will to survive in harsh circumstances. Everyone got what the film's about? Good. Ah, oh, shut up. But the character stuff is dynamic and tense as rifts form between the shipwrecked victims. Sexual. <sighs> violent. But I'll do my damnedest to get off this island. Even if I have to kill everybody to do it. Social. You depended on me to support your mother and brothers, didn't you? I put you through college and gave you a job in my company. Again, not subtle, but... How do mushrooms fit into this? Well, that's a question. There's not a lot to eat on the island, except... Mushrooms. But... But don't you even touch the mushroom. Initially, they don't seem to have any strong reason for this prohibition, but then they are menaced by nocturnal visits. Ah! I'm not sure what happened there. Did you eat some of those mushrooms? The mushrooms are definitely hallucinogenic. But they hadn't eaten them at that point, so that girl. scene remains a little mysterious. There must be a reason. Like the conch shell in Lord of the Flies, the mushrooms represent a vestige of civilization. We haven't got many rules, but there is this one. Hey, can't we eat the mushrooms now? Yeah, can't we? The way to live, so I... <laughs> That's probably a no. I might be wrong. About backhanding her across the face? Yeah, I'd call that an overreaction. Is that all you've got to say? But having built this air of danger around the mushrooms, the reveal is thrown away. I didn't tell you that once you've eaten it, you become a mushroom too. As if Honda is going, let's get this out of the way because it's a bit silly. They're half mushroom. I may be wrong, but it feels like Honda wanted to make a film about societal breakdown. We found it, and it first come first served around here. But was only allowed to do it through a sci-fi concept and Unlike in Godzilla, it does weaken it. Uh, I'm just telling you what I think. Let's... There's also a lot of stuff, including more nuclear metaphor, that never pays off. You shouldn't talk that way, you know. Still, it's a well-made film. And the central point remains intact. Tokyo is not very different from that island. Sort of. And then, I ate them! Apparently, and opinions differ online, that line was yeah, changed no. for the dub. In the Japanese version, he says, I never ate mind. the mushrooms. A far so? bleaker conclusion, suggesting that Tokyo's societal breakdown that isn't due to what we do, it's who we are. Cruel, sure, but I think we're basically different from the general run of people. We're all mushrooms. Hey, 
What the hell's the matter with you? Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe by clicking here or you can see more reviews here. Very simple question. Does anyone know if the Japanese line is actually I never ate the mushrooms? Please let us know in the comments below. We genuinely like to know. Thanks for watching. Hey, let's go.